Here's a bit of a control run through on our Enfly DQ404 40 horsepower four wheel drive tractor. You have a fuel gauge on the left, your RPM counter and hour meter in the centre there, and your water temperature gauge on the right. You've got all pressure light, you've got an alternator light, all that sort of normal stuff the dashboard has. Just over to our right here, we have our hand control unit for the front end loader. Open and close on the 4-in-1 bucket. Over to here we have our main joystick for the up and down and crowd control of the bucket and also a float position. So we have down is for up, up is for down on the main front end loader. We have left and right for curl of the bucket and we also have a lock over in position for a float position. Um, really comes into effect when backblading. Uh, very good, very nice, smooth controlling valve bank on these for quite quite tight precision work. Um, really impressive how they operate. We have a hand throttle here. We have forward reverse on the shuttle shift here. You have a brake pedal here and you also have your foot throttle here. As we've seen on some of the other videos, we have our draft control and our three point leakage control. As you can notice, we're all in the hand position there. Over onto our left hand side here, we have clutch, which is a very nice light clutch. Light clutch. Push in for starting, pull out for stopping. Little lock tag underneath. Same thing again. This is your rear PTO control. So you have a 540, 760, and then neutral in the center. Two more levers here for your rear remotes. You've reached down for this one to pull up for your four wheel drive. To disengage four wheel drive, quite simply, push down with your heel. Also on this side, similar setup, a push down with your heel to engage the dip lock. 